Hey, welcome everyone. It's Game Doc Gamer. Unboxing video for the Linksys. Uh, well, it says N300 here on the front of the box, but actually, if you go on the UPC code, this is a E1200 NP Linksys router. Um, my purpose for, for getting this model is uh, to put DDWRT on it. I find most routers, the software is bad, uh, lacking in many ways, and my purpose is that for this one is to have a client, a, uh, have it in client mode, connect to another router. So this comes with a uh, 300 megahertz Broadcom chip. I'm going to go ahead and start unboxing here while I talk. It has 32 megabytes of RAM and 8 megabytes of ROM if it's the version 2. As far as I know, there's no version 3. There's no, most routers you see in the stores these days have a version, revision number. This does not. It's rather unusual. But anyway, I'm taking the shrink wrap off now. It has no USB ports. It has four Ethernet ports that run at uh, 10, 100, but it's not a gigabit uh, switch on there, so it's just 100 megabits. I wouldn't say this is state of the art. Now there's the AC standard, but I just needed a cheaper router. I'm trying to figure out where where this opens. Oh, I see. You got to open the door on the bottom. It's like when you have to pee. <laughs> Alright, so we have... Make sure this... We have a power adapter here. I got this for $45 at the store here. I didn't want to pay $100, $120. There's a really nice router I would like to have for $100 cost $120, $130. It's just a little too much, too rich for my blood. Anyway, so here's the, you can see the Linksys word there in E1200. doesn't say E1200 on the box really much, but it says right on the top of the router. So it does uh, the 300, the dual link N. And here's the back. I can has uh, good ventilation on it. On the underside, anyway. Here's the back. Let's see if I can get this lit for you guys. And in focus. All right. So we have four Ethernet and a WAN or eth internet. The yellow one is WAN. A reset button, the power adapter. So it's a very basic router. Does 300 megabits wireless if you use the dual link over two channels. So that's, there it is, that's the router. And we have a, uh, what is this? It's a reset button here. Right here is a reset button for a paper clip or however you want to reset the firmware reset to stock settings. So there it is. Not much to say. There's uh, there's also a link start start guide and an Ethernet cable. And that's it. There's nothing else in the box. So I think this will suit my needs just fine. will be to upload all the videos and it's really for my main internet connection and the power adapter here not much to say very simple all right thanks for watching this is game Doc gamer I also did uh, I got uh, remember if you saw my other previous pre-unboxing video this uh, mouse the M 
6980 gigabyte. I bought another one. I, I kind of like it. If I find a mouse that I'm rather happy with, I'll go ahead and buy another one. At least that's kind of my what I've decided to do now. Um, it feels good in my hand. It feels good. It has uh, something like is it 12,000 frames per second? The optical sensor will sense the mouse pad. Very high rate. They have higher end mice, but they're wireless. I think there is one higher end wired mouse from Gigabyte presently. But uh, it's really nice. I'll, I could just unbox it now for you guys. I'll do a separate video. But I've got some other stuff I still haven't done here. I'll show you my shrine. This has become my. Uh, this has become my shrine in the kitchen and on the table here. The wife has lost access to the table here. <laughs> this is all the stuff from the previous... I still haven't unboxed it. That's kind of the uh, problem with a YouTube channel. I want to share it with you guys, so I just delay it. But none of this is urgent that I need right now. None of this stuff, so... Except the router, I really need to get that working. <laughs> so for the time being, <laughs> this is the... This is the technology shrine. All right, have a good, good one. This is Game Dog Gamer. Thanks for watching. Links this E1200 NP router. Seems cool. They, they're supposed to be stable. That's why I picked this. I have a TP. I have a TP Link router now doing the job, and it's just like it's it's too cheap. I, it's a twenty dollar router at TP Link, and it locks up when I'm doing high bandwidth. Anything over, it just. Like if I'm doing several things or high, like uh, uploading a video or downloading Steam patches or games, uh, it, the, it resets and I have to reboot the thing. So I, have to, I had to get this. And I'll let you know how it goes in the comments. How if this is stable? It should be. It's Linksys is a better brand than TP-Link, but it varies. You know, Linksys is trying to lock people from putting DDWRT. They're trying to lock people out from putting DDWRT on their or other. Uh, custom firmware on their routers so but not all of them yet alright thanks for watching this is Game Doc Gamer.